what is up gamers and gamers from all around the world hopefully you guys can see me so i am going to best buy right now to go pick up my black friday games that i want to pick up purchase um best buy being sunday today november 22 they already having their sales and rather than me going on black friday which is on friday to avoid you know the crowd you know this and that i'm gonna just go to best buy and record me picking up the items that i want so i hope you guys enjoy this one happy sunday and let's get this day rolling just warming up my car I was not expecting to go out today, but I saw Wire64 or BestBuy.com saying that the video game sale starts today. All right. Hope you guys enjoy this one, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out. <laughs> my early Black Friday shopping, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoy. This is going to be my Black Friday 2020. I'll talk to you guys later. All right. Peace out, homies. Yo, they got everything ready for Black Friday, but I'm gonna just get my games. Uh, that blue controller looks so nice. So let's see. Yeah, I want this one. Um, uh oh. Let me see what else can we get. Oh, they got more stuff. Here, oh, they got CDs. Yo, that is awesome, guys. That's the first time I've seen. Um, I am looking for the Power Ranger one. Hopefully, they have it. If not, I'll get it for a different console. Sometimes they hide it really behind certain games. This one's out of the case. If I can't find it, I'll just get it for the Xbox. But I really want it for the Switch. Ooh, I wonder how much this is. Oh, it's really hard to record with one hand. Give me one second. Let's tell this one. Oh no, I think they sold out. Here, let me go like the PlayStation version. But I really want this one for the Switch. Um, where's the need for speed? I don't know if I should get this for the Xbox too. Or for the PlayStation. Hmm. But where's the Power Rangers line? What if they don't have it for the PlayStation 4 either? Uh, no, that would terribly suck, you guys. Uh, let me see. Let me go look at the Xbox. Is this Hopefully they do have it for the Xbox. We got some plushies. Here. If not, I'm gonna have to ask on the associate. Hmm. Oh, there it is. Is this 20 bucks? Hopefully this is the one that's $20. I guess I'll take all these three. Although I wanted the Power Ranger for the Switch, but I cannot find it, so. One second, guys. I'm just trying to be fair with all my consoles. <laughs> um, what else was on sale? This is for the Xbox. Hmm, I don't know which one to get for the Xbox or for the PS4. Hmm. Here, give me one second, fellas. I'm just trying to read the back. See how much memory, what's the difference. 
This one's 20 gigabytes. This one doesn't say nada. But can you experience 4K? Hmm. You know what? I'll just get it for the PlayStation. Because it doesn't say for the Xbox. Anything. It doesn't say how many memories. Yeah, I'll just get it for the PlayStation. Well, I'm going to keep searching for the uh, Switch. So, wish me luck, guys. Talk to you guys later. Peace out. So this is how it looks. Oh, it looks so small compared to the Series X. Alright. See ya. Alright, what's up guys? So I just came back from Best Buy and I picked up a lot of cool stuff. And since Black Friday, right now the deals are on sale. I've had a $20 certificate from Best Buy. And with that, I purchased a game and a plushie too. So I'm gonna do an unboxing next. Should I include in this video? Since this is gonna be short, I think I'm including in this video. My Black Friday <laughs> 2020 shopping experience done early. Now I'm heading home. It wasn't that crowded, but a lot of food. I saw the pickup items. Everybody bought the Switch. They had a ton of Switch. The one that included with the Mario Kart and some other goodies. And I saw a PlayStation 5 there. What else did I see? I saw a lot of games too. I was taking a peek while the lady went to go pick up my games at the pickup order department. And people, yes, are doing the pickup, which I should have done, but I want to experience the fun, the excitement coming to the store and just choosing the game. Even though I wanted one game for the Switch, but I bought it for the Xbox. So I bought a PlayStation 4, Xbox, and a Switch game to make equal and another xbox games oh whatever i am tired bro not tired but i'm just out of breath and i'll talk to you guys later i'm going home i should have not skipped gym today so i'm gonna make up my gym workout tomorrow and i guess i'll do an unboxing in this video hopefully you guys enjoy it all right peace out all right what's up guys gamers and gamers What's up, my ladies, my homies, everybody, mi familia. I am back from Black Friday Best Buy shopping, and I will be doing some unboxing right now. But first, let me show you what I picked up. I got this Sonic plush. Keep in mind, I had, they gave me a $20 gift certificate. Well, rewards. I have $20 rewards. And I have another $10 coming up because I pre-ordered the Call of Duty. And... I remember when you pre-order the Call of Duty, you would get $10. And I have an extra $5 bonus certificate. So that's why I love shopping at Best Buy. And this was all thanks for, well, this was thanks for the Xbox Series X and some other goodies that I picked up. So that gave me a lot of points. Plus I use my credit card, so that gives me extra points. And this is what I picked up. So you could consider it sort of free. I got this free. This only cost me 10 bucks. And I, I wanted it, Zelda. I mean, not Zelda, I'm sorry. Sonic the Hedgehog. I Every time I go see, if you if you see my previous video, you will see that I always want this plushie. And you know what? Since I had the extra money, well, free gifts, I decided to pick it up. It looks adorable, man. So I got Pikachu and Sonic hooking up together. Well, in a good way. <laughs> not hooking up, but hanging out. All right. Next on the list, I got Rare Replay. Power Ranger Battle for the Grid, Need for Speed Hot Pursuit, and WWE Battlegrounds. This was $20, 25 20 and this was $10. I've always wanted it this game ever since they announced it. Oops, we got the choppers around us. $10 for 30 games? That is not bad, guys. And I always wanted to play um, Bad for Conquer. I never played this game. Neither have I played Banjo Kazooie or some of what are the games are here. Um, I've never played these games actually. Pinata, Perfect Dart. I never played it, and it comes with Perfect Dart Zero. So guys, this is worth it. Ten dollars for all these games. You know what? That's beautiful. P 
Power Ranger Battle for the Grid Collector's Edition. So this comes with a bonus character, Season 1 Pass, Lauren Shiba. And it has all these awesome Power Rangers characters. The original Red Ranger Green. And is that the original Black Ranger? I am so excited for this, guys. This is what I wanted to. I wanted it for the Switch, but then I saw the Collector's Edition. So, and it's Xbox Series X. All right. And then Need for Speed. I played this a long time ago. I think it was 2010. I played it for the Xbox 360 online. And this was a lot, a lot of fun. And for $25, a remastered. I am looking forward to playing this online. You play against four, against four cops, against street racers. And last but not least, WWE Battlegrounds for the Switch. We got Austin, Rock, Taker, Roman Reigns, Cena, uh, Ronda Rousey, Charlie, Booker T, Andre. And we just have so many characters. On the back, we have Roman Reigns with John Cena. And, you know, it's perfectly fun on the handheld. You know, what if I have to go take my Switch? All right, so let's do the unboxing. Uh, let's do the Switch unboxing. Why not? Okay. So this was the one that I wanted to pick up first for the Switch, and it was the only one there too. I was looking for some more, but they didn't have it. So I was really lucky enough to find this. And I cannot wait to show it on my channel, play it on my channel. I think if Eddie Guerrero is here, I believe Eddie Guerrero is here. So I'm gonna use him as my first character. And I've heard nothing but good reviews about WWE 2K Battlegrounds compared to the other one, 2K20 which was really terrible. And what do we have here? Oh, snap, so we get Edge as a DLC. What? Guys, that is awesome. And then we get Super Cards, which I'm gonna try it out. I don't know. I'm still debating if I should try it out or not. And then we get the cartridge itself, which is, it has a little artwork from the cover, which is really great. And you get Rated R Superstar Edge. Yo, I remember him fighting with Matt Hardy ever since I saw that match at SummerSlam, I think, live. And they had to stop the match because he busted up Matt Hardy really bad. But at the next pay-per-view, they were fighting inside a steel cage match. I forgot what it was, the pay-per-view. I think it was No Mercy. But hey, you could read that. But it, legit, I am glad he's back. It's just terrible that since the COVID, things happen. And we just removed this plastic away and then we have some instruction menu no well, not really limited warranty so that's game number uno next remastered need for speed hot pursuit guys i've saved money here buying these games i have a ton of games to play during the holidays this i played a long time ago with my little brother so i wish they remade need for speed on the ground one and two because that was the classic this is okay but they should have remastered on the grounds one and two everybody's asking for that ea i don't know what's going on i don't know why they haven't made any remake of the original but what do we have back here oh just driving controls i mean it's sweet that they include the menu i mean the how to play rather than have it in the game so i am thankful for that at least they add a let me smell it ah you always gotta smell that brand new brand new game unboxing case brand new out of the out of the box i don't know if that makes sense whatever <laughs> okay so let's leave rare for last since that's the one that i'm excited for power rangers battle for the grid this cost 30 dollars or 40 40 30 dollars and i got it for 20 so i saved 10 dollars and i am so happy i've read good things about this one too it's a fighting style and it includes all these characters back there man look at that you got some more original ones too Yo, this is it. This is the one that I am definitely going to play. This is the first one that I'm going to play. Put in my channel, my content, get the same reaction as I'm playing for the first time. And I'm going to use the Red Ranger or the Green Ranger. And even it says Fun and Furious, the surprise game of the year. Yo, this game is underrated. I've heard nothing again but good reviews for this game. And it's the collector's edition too. So uh, that's a plus a bonus for me. So I'm hyped about this one. Okay, let's remove this one. Let's put it to the side. And if there's a DLC, okay, never mind, it's on the other side. So this is a female, Lauren Shiba. Hmm. 
I haven't seen, not up to date with the Power Rangers series, only the original ones from Power, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, Power Rangers in Space, Galaxy, Turbo. And then I did check out another one, is Dino Thunder. I like the song, <laughs> but other than that, I love the movie too, that they made, the recent movie. I've heard they're gonna reboot it again. And let's see how that goes. Well, Tommy Oliver has to make his appearance. Okay. And last but not least, for $10, guys, this was a great pickup. Rare replay. I believe this is one of the first games that came out when the Xbox One was released. Or was announced, if I'm not mistaken. And it's 30 hit games, one epic collection. Honestly, I don't know why I didn't pick this up. Maybe because it was sold out everywhere. Yes, that's what it was. Everywhere it was sold out. Either you had to pay a huge amount of dollars for it or yeah, give it to the scalpers, which I am not gonna do, forget that. And surprisingly, Best Buy had it on sale for $10. And you know what? This will save us. So this one's definitely another one I'm looking forward to. It's gonna keep me busy, preoccupied as well. And for $10, you can't beat that. Okay, let's see what's inside and cool art design oh my that is awesome guys whoa look at that you have ready e to m it is battle toad and perfect dark zero banjo kazooie i am actually looking forward to playing this without a doubt no question asked so guys best buy already have their video games on sale i think target does too and gamestop hasn't officially announced other video game sales but i think i'm done purchasing all my games this is all i wanted guys and i have 15 dollars for gamestop since i purchased the ps5 they gave me a plus i have five dollars too for the monthly reward membership so i have 20 dollars for them and i don't know what to check i'm gonna go on their website and see what i can find well thank you guys hopefully you guys enjoy this unboxing of my pickups this will be a perfect thumbnail it's like a bookcase not a bookcase, but you know what I mean. Those books, like, if it makes sense. Oh, yeah, and I forgot my Sonic. I got Sonic, too. Oh, what a beautiful pickup. So I'm going to avoid the line Black Friday, COVID. If you're going to do the line Black Friday coming up next Friday or this Friday, well, Friday, just be careful. Stay safe. Stay six feet apart from each other. Take sanitizer. Put your mask on. And pray to God that everything goes well. All right, guys, I love you with all my heart. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe, hit the notification bell, like this video, dislike, comment, because I do tend to respond back. And as always, to all my gamers and gamers, have a wonderful day and God bless. Peace out. Hopefully you guys enjoy this one. <laughs>